Yeah, the, the deal with the, the deal that the way I was explained it was this. Cancer cells are slightly easier to kill off than normal healthy cells. But what they're trying to do is they're trying to kill you off as much as possible, get you to that edge where you can kill off the cancer cells, but not the healthy ones. It's just what doesn't kill you makes everything else just feel like shit. So it's, uh, it's just, uh, it's horrible. I, I, it's one of those things like you hope that they come up with some kind of new technology that just is better than that because God, it sucks. If I can actually show you this too, um, when you look straight down the, the valve, okay, do you see on this one, look right there. You see how looking straight down the valve, see how when you look down both of them, you can see that, see how that part in the middle bulges out, right? That is an air restriction, right? So that's the kind of stuff that I'm trying to shave down to get rid of that extra little bit of air restriction because that little tiny bit could be, you know, that much more air, which I can then combust and make more power in my car. Oh, dude, God. Yeah, those suck. I. I was lucky enough not to reach that point where they had to do that, but I, I pretty much did three days on one arm, two days on the other, and I alternated it back and forth just to, because I was literally getting burn marks. It was, uh, yeah. Did I forget to turn the microphone off? I did. I'm sorry, guys.
Yeah, sorry about that, guys. It, I thought I, like, I, I wasn't thinking and I just started going at it. And I'm like, I'm so focused on trying to, trying to do this that I was like, oh, crap. And then, yeah. things too is uh, who was it that was talking to me about uh, doing golf ball dimples on the intake to be honest like I could probably do this and it'd be fine that rougher boundary layer for the intake is okay because what ends up happening is that because the the fuel injector sprays at a closed intake valve right and for that millisecond worth of time while it sprays and all the fuel droplets are out there um having a rough a slightly rougher boundary layer makes it so the fuel droplets don't actually hit the cylinder wall uh they're kind of it's kind of like suspended in the air that's there and when the valve opens then you know it's sucked in and and car goes right on the exhaust, because you're dealing with combusted gases, that one though, I've got to completely polish it because if you have any rough areas on it, the stuff tends to build up and stick to it and go from that. So I don't, I don't want that, so yeah. And again, before I do this, turn the microphone off again.